Oh, good, good, good. I got AJ tonight between, between 4 and 8, something like that. You following any of the undercard? Uh, Hamza. Ah, uh, that's oh. a match made in heaven. We just spoke to Tyler. But I thought okay, I love you, baby. Okay. Harry Kate, I just think Tyler's style is made for Hamza. Malik, there's... Um, how tall is he? Uh, Hamza? No, how tall is he? Five, he's just sat there now, Tyler. Uh, five, ten. Hamza's six, two, six, oh, no. three. He's right, and he uses his reach and beautifully. Better and better and better and better. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and it just seems, I think this is his time now. Yeah, but uh, he's definitely in his moment, definitely in his moment. Oh, I'm looking forward to him. You know, I don't want to look past this guy at all, but Hamza puts in a lot of work over yeah. in LA at Rick House Boxing Gym. He got one of the best strength coaches, Holly. I mean, I got one of the best coaches in the game there in boxing, uh, Ricky Funes from Ting Goose Boxing Gym. Uh, him and his team has been, have invested in themselves. They put in the time. He's extremely disciplined. You know, in my opinion, he's a promoter's dream. I was telling uh, my wife that yesterday. So I'm expecting good things from Hamza. But uh, this kid may be tough tonight, but we'll see because this is becoming champion. It's all about passing these kind of tests. Yeah, and he's so articulate. Like you say, he's a promoter's dream. Yeah. He's so articulate. They've just made him ambassador of Riyadh. Yes. So we're expecting big things from Hamza. Yes. Um, Deserving Yeah. Kakachi has got a great fight tonight with Josh Warrington. Yes. Um, I think that could be a bit of a show stealer, but I'm going for Bawatsi Hutchinson to be one of the best I fights. I'm going with Bawatsi uh, Hutchinson with... to be the best fight on the undercard. That's the most, that's the most anticipated fight for me. Yeah, 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 same, yeah, yeah, same. I'm very big on Hutchinson, I'm very big on Bawatsi. Yeah, it's probably the best matchup. Yeah, oh, definitely. Yes, on definitely. The Look, take nothing away from Josh Padley and Chamberlain. They're all going to be great fights, and I think. This Riyadh season now, we know we're getting the 50-50s, we know oh. we're getting the fights we've always Every wanted to see. Yes. Every fight is 50-50, yes. And I would say that's the, the great thing about Riyadh season. Yeah. Is, yeah you, fighters are going to make the money they always wanted to make, but they are also going to be in the fights that they probably wouldn't have wanted a little bit sooner. So these guys are going to be fighting. Life is better. The purses are bigger. But you're, you're going to be fighting top competition. You got, you know, you got to uh, send a turkey for that because he have dream fights in his head, and he sure. don't just keep them as dreams. He turn them into reality. Yeah, he's making them. Yes. He's making them yes. reality. Yes. While you're here, Malik, mm -hmm. Deontay, how's yes. he doing? Doing very, very good. Um, well rested. Fighting is still in his heart. He still wants to fight. And um, uh, uh, we in 2024 now, so we'll see how the beginning of 2025 will sound and look for him. Lovely. It'd be good yeah. to see him back. Absolutely. You, you, you got him anyway. We know that. Absolutely. But Malik, thank you so much for talking to us. Yes, God bless you, my man.